weight loss, keeping healthy, eating clean. Let's talk about it. Now, as you know, this channel is for women to self-improve themselves in all aspects in skill, mind and body. One of the aspects of moving forward and self-improvement is eating healthy and keeping up with your physique. Now, I am no expert and I make mistakes and I indulge in desserts myself, but it's all about balance. Now, self-improvement in regards to weight loss helps you physically and helps you mentally. So any mental health um, that you may be having, any depression, this is one of the ways to step out of it. And as you know, keeping physical helps with the weight loss, your weight loss journey. And really, really does, I don't know what it does to the brain. Like I said, I'm no expert, but it does something to the brain where you're, you've got this power that you didn't know existed. But when I started my journey, I tried everything I can and I still have a bucket list of things to do. So here are a few things that I accomplished or the way I try and lose my weight. Here I really believe in walking and so I'm walking and it doesn't matter the weather, sometimes I walk in the rain, in the snow, even if it's five minutes just to get my blood circulating. This was last summer, so this is in my local park, I attempted jogging, as you can see I was out of breath, <laughs> I was about to collapse I think. Oh and I try and switch it up a bit, so here as you can see I go to the woods, I like to go to the woods sometimes. And there's me chatting away in a different area. It's just keeping it busy. Oh, well, yes. How can I forget? I tried track running as well. I went on the tracks. I did my walking, my jogging, and I thought, let me try running. I went twice. I didn't go back, but it was worth it. I loved it. I love the feeling of it. Inshallah, maybe I'll revisit it in the future. Oops. Um, and this is just to show you, perhaps I do go... And I, and I do, I am naughty sometimes and I go to a dessert parlor. This is me and my girls. We were going ice skating. That's another thing I've done to keep fit. There's me and my boots. And there's, I also tried um, basketball. I really like basketball. I don't know what I was doing, but I just liked it. You know, I used to play it a lot in high school. And yes, I did it. I did it. Oh, and here's another treat just to show you I'm not perfect and that I do indulge sometimes. Oh, and I tried rock climbing. Never again. I went once. I kept active, which is good, but I didn't enjoy it as much. I've also got some weights at home and I attempt skipping rope. I bought this skipping rope and I'm not going to lie. I use it twice. Um, I should really use it more. Um, I do use these rubber bands more often than I did the skipping rope and a bit, bit, bit of weights. And on top of that, I also do a bit of um, online workouts and I tried classes, um, like women's classes where we did a little bit of physical aerobics. Um, and like I said, I always put a random workout, whatever I'm feeling at the moment. So just keep an active, active, active. And you might think, wow, Fatima, you've tried a lot of things. Yes, and I, I that's what... I think that's the thing about me. I love stepping out of my comfort zone and trying new things. And I think this is really good. And I stuck with the things that I like. Like I, I do like weights and walking. I've stuck with my walking and I'm not perfect, but maybe try that. Try different things. Try stepping out of your comfort zone in regards to um, different sports as well. Um, I've still got a whole list of things to do, you know, anything that keeps you active. So it's not necessarily um, just uh, in the gym, anything. All right. And number two is um, obviously eating more healthy. Now I still eat, as you can see, I do still eat unhealthy foods, uh, but there, there are necessities sometimes. There are not really. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to um, approve it to myself. What I would suggest and I've tried everything. I've tried a keto diet, um, all the diets out, not all, but a lot of them out there. And I would say the most that helped me is intermittent fasting. I mean, this is, we, as a Muslim, we fast anyway, right? So it's, it's not that hard in a sense that I know what to expect, you know, um, but the difference is you can um, drink water and, and your coffees and your teas. So I do intermittent fasting. If you don't know what that is, um, Google it. If you want to know more, let me know. Um, and sometimes I don't, 
do it. So it just depends um, on my social situation. Salads. Now salads is my key here. <laughs> I might say that I'd have my pasta. Um, I'll have a cheat day where I'll have a burger, but then I'll eat clean the next day. I'll have a big bowl of salad. And what I've learned is to, um, to be creative with your salads, right? So I had loads of carrots at home and I thought, why not show you a couple of salads I do at home? this I'm making is a Moroccan salad my childhood salad so I'm peeling some uh, carrots chopping them up and then I'll put them in a pan to boil until tender and here I'll add some spices like a bit of uh, cumin uh, salt pepper paprika crushed garlic and some parsley and I didn't use all of the parsley olive oil in the pan put all the ingredients in and warm it up so not we're not frying we're just kind of infusing those spices and and the garlic and you can eat this hot or cold as well you can warm it up my and I have another um type of salad that I make but it's not really a salad you'll see what I mean let's 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 play it so I do, I get the carrots again, I grate a bunch of carrots, I think I grated about four carrots here, orange juice, squeeze the orange juice, and all I do is mix it in. So I've got a bit of my savory salad and my sweet carrot salad. Um, sometimes what I also do is add uh, apple, so half an apple, just to mix it up a bit. Um, and that's and that's those are the two kind of savory and sweet carrot salads I like to do I just like being creative with my salads um, because it can get a bit boring those are the two things I would say keep active any way possible step out of your comfort zone in regards to trying new things including sport and also um, try different salads be creative with your salads I hope that helped and was of benefit to you. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe and like and comment. Do you have any particular salads that you like or um, a sport maybe you really, really want to do? Give me some ideas. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to explore. Until next time, take care of yourself.